Hello everyone, how are you? Today we are going to start writing together our narrative story as we discussed before. Here he is asking us if you could visit any planet in the solar system. Which planet would you like to visit the most and why? Read the beginning and the ending of the story below and then write a suitable button. So, as a beginning for writing the story, here we have a story about going to space, visiting a planet. And he gave us the beginning and the ending that we are going to read them together. Then we are going to start giving this story a title and the button, the main things that we have done in our trip to, to space. Let's see. As for the beginning, he left the title empty as I told you. Once upon a time, my science club sent me on a discovery mission to planet Mars. So he told me that we are visiting planet Mars. Once upon a time, this is when, as I told you, this is the first thing we are going to start with, the settings of the story. Once upon a time, my science club sent me on a discovery mission a mission to discover planet Mars. I was very excited about this trip. I started to read about planet Mars using the internet and I found out a lot of new mind-blowing information. So, this is the beginning. We just started to read about the planet and he found mind-blowing, which means incredible or wonderful or amazing information. We are asked to write how did his trip start? How did his trip start? What did he do in it? And we will check the ending together. Trip 
we come down because we are going to open the quotation marks to write what did they say. Oh, my God. 
population of planets, stars, and rockets that we use to travel to space with the rocket that we use to go to space with. Okay? I told them that Mars is called the red planet and they were so proud of me. They were so proud of me that I searched and I found some information. Okay, like that Mars is called the Red Planet. Then, let's start our trip. Then, I went to put on, which means to wear, my terrific, also means fantastic, wonderful, amazing, Space suit to wear on space suit. You know, if we are traveling to space, we cannot keep wearing just the same uh, clothes that we wear here on Earth. We must wear space suit to breathe and to protect you from the weather up there in space. So I went to put on my terrific space suit. The suit was heavy and white. You know, when we wear the suit, it's very heavy because it has got things that will allow you to breathe and these things, okay? And uh, its color is uh, white. The helmet, what's the helmet? The thing that we wear over our head. It has got glass from here to go to space, to breathe inside it. The helmet was huge. Okay, so he put on, or I put on my uh, special clothes, the space suit and the helmet to start my trip to space. to the rocket. We went to the rocket that is going to take us up to space, which was enormous. 
enormous, super huge. Ok? Uh, ok, that's when we went to uh, the uh, rocket. Then, inside the rocket, there were lots of machines and buttons, you know, when you enter a machine or a big rocket or the plane or anything that, that is going to move, just like the car, but the car has got less things because, because it just moves here inside the streets and these things so this will travel to space have big machines and lots of buttons okay after that the rocket Launched. What do we mean by launch? Started to fly up. Launched. Okay. To the spacious, very large space. Large space. Okay, dark. Because the space is dark. Or space. So the rocket launched to the spacious door space. Once we stopped. A little scared. Once we stop, I felt a little scared. Okay. Later, we stepped to take a step out. of the rocket. We step out of the rocket. We were floating, you know, in space. You can't stand like that on in the space you can't stand like that just on earth or uh, on another planet okay but in the space itself you will be floating we were floating till we landed on planet Mars Okay. It really looked reddish. Because you know it is called the uh, red planet because it looks reddish. It really looked reddish. And 
We saw two moons going around it. You know, we have a moon that we see at night here on Earth. On Mars, uh, there are two moons going around. Thank you for watching. See you next time.